Now, you guys know I don't really do like information videos and stuff like that, so that's not what I'm gonna call this. I fully hate doing those. I don't like that. I find it boring. <laughs> Whilst I'm sat in the tower, damn near cheating on infected, I thought I'd talk to you guys real quick. I feel like this video might have like minimal editing, so I just want to talk to you guys first of all about like the state of Black Ops 4. Like, what's going on with this, man? Oh, flip. But honestly, mainly, I just thought it'd be a good idea for me to give you like my opinion on what's going on. Do you know what I mean? There's a lot going on right now. A lot of people didn't talk about it, and I've never really like given my full opinion on it. That's what we're gonna do today, and I can talk because we're stood in the top of the tower. You guys know this is the spot for infected man yo basically i'm pretty sure you guys only clicked on for the title first so we're getting a new oh flip that scared me yeah. we're getting a new specialist as you guys may know already i'm not early to this at all it's supposed to be the ripper from black ops 3 i don't know if you guys remember that correctly but it was the one that had the knife thing and it had active camo as well so you could go invisible that's one specialist that we've not seen in this game yet so that's supposed to be coming i don't know when don't ask me when i would assume in the next operation but we know we'll try out command it could come in the next two years to be honest even though it's been leaked now it's probably gonna come in 2020 Oh, there we go. All right, they're starting to come up now. Come on. It's five effect. Yo, this teammate better get out. Why are you lying down, bud? The reason why I say 2020 is because, yo, you guys know the Arsenal Sandstorm, whatever it's called, was supposed to come yesterday. Whoa, whoa, he playing games. He tried fading away. Arsenal Sandstorm was supposed to come yesterday. It didn't end up happening. It got delayed. How's a map that is a remake of a map that is in this game going to get delayed? I, I don't get it. I don't get it. But he didn't end up adding it into the game, which is a little bit unfortunate. I mean, I didn't really care too much about it in the first place, but it got delayed. So that hype for that is already gone. But the only way you die up here is by like a lucky throw. Bro, teammate, stop nudging me. The only way you die up here is like by a lucky throwing knife. So if I die, you guys know, you guys know why. I know that, yo, this guy is nudging me all over the place. And I don't know, I don't think he understands how easy you can die. You can die so, you can die so easy. Bang. Oh, flip. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad, G. <laughs> Yo, bro, I was the guy at the back gonna die. <laughs> bro, I'm, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. He's gotta be. Whoa, he climbed up the side. He's gotta be mad as hell. He feels betrayed. Oh, wait, someone's gotta die. Oh, yeah, we're not gonna be able to carry on this street. Unless I let my teammate die somehow. Or he gets hit by a tomahawk. Or I guess I do. But yeah, it's, it's over. We got 16 though, so basically, yeah, new specialist is coming, the Ripper, and if you're wondering how that's going to work, like, is it going to be active camo again? I don't think so. I don't think it's going to be active camo at all. I feel like that would be pretty OP. I wouldn't be mad if it was, because that would be a pretty cool thing to make a video on. So, should I ask him what do you think of Black Ops 4? Hold up. Hello. Hello. Yo, what do you guys think of Black Ops 4? What? What What do you think of Black Ops 4? It's alright. Is it, is it the best card? I'd say Black Ops 2. Man said Black Ops 2. My opinion, honestly, is the fact that at its core, this could be one of the best Call of Duty's. Honestly, it really could. Like, it's honestly one of my favorite Call of Duty's. That's, been, that's me being dead serious. But back to what I was saying, it was pretty much leaked in the files of Black Ops 4. Someone somehow found it, I think, in one of the update files where he found like different voice files. And one of the voice files was for Spectre or Ripper, whatever its name is, in multiplayer of Black Ops 4, which is pretty cool. So we should be seeing that coming pretty soon. I, I, I would assume, I would only assume it would come in the next operation don't quote me on that but i feel like it'd be like zero now also after that a smoke grenade was found in the gear section of black ops 4 i mean i don't really i didn't really know what that meant i like i was dumb as hell thinking oh okay that just that just that just means a smoke grenade is coming into multiplayer but then you gotta think about it right smoke grenades aren't supposed to be in the gear section anyway king brothers and our game you know oh wait these guys know me yo what's up blades yo yo what's up man no i was watching you like black ops 3 oh for real yeah Wait, you say Black Ops 3? Oh, well, that one. Well, two. Oh, yeah, that's crazy. Bye bad, I'm just playing at the same time. I enjoy like speaking to you guys, but pretty much the smoke grenade was found in the gear, and obviously that doesn't belong there, like with the acoustic sensor and stuff like that. So people are assuming now that one of the specters' ability or the ripper's ability will be like a smoke grenade, and you'll probably be able to like see through it. So you'll be like, I don't know, you might see an outline of people, or you might just be able to see straight through the smoke. I don't know, that's just what people are saying, to be honest, because you gotta think about it, yeah. A few moments. Oh my god, yo, get me up, get me up, get me up, get me up. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But yeah, in Black Ops 3, the specialists that came from Black Ops 3 to Black Ops 4, they're not even, they've not even got the same abilities, well, most of them anyway. You know, Tempest, it's it's Tempest, but it's not the same Tempest as Black Ops 3. It's all just a little bit different, and like, the, the other ability, like, the, the, the... 
Oh my. Like the Seeker drone wasn't in Black Ops 3, do you know what I mean? They're a little bit different, so when Ripper comes here, it's, probably, it's not even called Ripper, I swear it's called Spectre, I'm just calling it that. The Ripper's like the actual ability, right? Either way, it's probably not going to be the same, do you know what I mean? I don't know what it's going to be, but it's coming. I have no idea where but it's coming, I just wanted to let you guys know about that. You have been infected. Hunt the survivors. Yeah. If I don't get hit, whoa, if I don't get hit by a lucky tomahawk, we can do this. We're gonna get hit by a lucky tomahawk. Run a brutal as well. Flip, man! I'm mad as hell. I'm mad as hell. I only like, bro, we would have got that nuke if more people survived. If more, I mean, if more people died. If more people died, I would have got that nuke easy. It's just because someone was in a glitch, man. Flip! Yeah. What you say? Yeah, I'm using a Titan. Yeah. <laughs> But now listen, I know a lot of people want to know like my personal opinion on Black Ops 4 right now. It, it, it's a little bit mad. It's a little bit mad. Honestly, the main thing for me is just that I'm, I'm confused. I'm a little bit confused as to like all the planning, the ideas that they've got going on right now. That's what I'm confused about. Do you know what I mean? I'm not really mad. Oh, wait. Oh, flip. I'm dead. I'm dead. Where's this guy? Yo, teammate. I love that. It's going to wait. Oh. Oh, flip. I should not have got that free piece off. I should not have got that free piece. Yo, I can't talk. I'm sorry. I fully not even got the right streaks. I'm, I'm kind of mad about that. What the hell is this? Who, who throws these? Wait. Since when? Since when? Yo, I can't remember if I've already said this in this video, but I really do enjoy Black Ops 4. And that's not just me saying that. I really do love Black Ops 4 in general. Like, the core game itself. One of the best Call of Duty's, in my opinion. And I, I will stick to that. I said it when the beta was out. I said it when the actual game came out. I really enjoyed it. Even the Wait. Yeah, the core game itself, the camos, all that different stuff. I really like Black Ops 4, do you know what I mean? But the thing to carry it on throughout the whole year, it needs consistent updates. That's what it needs and that's what it's lacking. But the, the one thing that confuses me, and again, I would use the word confused, is the fact that, bro, they've got stuff to add into the game. They're just not doing it. They've got the sniper, which has been leaked for about, bro, it feels like months. It's been months since it first got leaked and they decided not to add it in yet. Um, I don't I don't, I don't, don't get why. I, I really don't get why at all. It doesn't make any sense in my head whatsoever, but I don't know. It just seems like they're taking the sweet time with these, you know, updates and stuff like that. I don't get why. Clearly, either they're being restricted with, you know, how how much updating you can actually do by Activision. They're seeing all of us complain. They're seeing, seeing all of us like wanting these updates. So I believe there's some sort of restriction for them, for Treyarch themselves by Activision to the point where they can't update the game as much as they want to. Which is sad, which is sad, but you know, Activision are the main ones. You know, they have the say in what goes on. Listen, Treyarch, yo, grab Activision. Grab Activision, drop him real quick, pick him up, drop him again, and then pick him up and drop him again and be like, hey, listen, we need to drop these things. We need to drop them right now because it's getting ridiculous. This is actually getting ridiculous. Was that hit? Oh, flip. I need to focus up. Arsenal Sandstorm. And by the way, I'm only playing the effects because I just want to talk to you guys, man. This is a chill video. I just want to chill and talk to you guys real quick about everything that's going on in my head. But it's like, yo, we, we need these new things. Basically, what I'm trying to say is me personally, man, I still love Black Ops 4 at its core value. When I'm playing with other people, I still really enjoy Black Ops 4, but it's more so on the content side of things. But I also have to say, too, I'm really thankful for this because it does... Oh, mad. <laughs> it does make you put more time into your content. It, it does make you think of more content, you know, more creative content, all different stuff, which I guess is a good thing in the long run. So I am appreciative of it. And I am thinking of more ideas for you guys to, to enjoy. Like, trust me, we're working on some things. I'm pretty sure, like, a lot of the college is... Oh, wait, people need to die. Hold up. People at the back of the map, lads. Go get them. I'm going to stand back just in case. Oh, he jumped, he jumped out. He jumped out. Die. He got killed too. What the flip? Look at him. Oh, you're sick. You're solid, mate. Absolutely solid. Look at you. Pretty sure all the college YouTubers you guys know. I mean, I've been speaking to him. I've been speaking to him all, and we're really trying to like think of you know better content to upload for you guys rather than just the boring stuff because that's boring. That's been boring to me for a while anyway. You know, just having to rely on like new weapons coming out, new variants. You know, I've been wanting to be a lot more creative with my content as you guys have probably seen. But I do want to collaborate with a lot more YouTubers as well. So a lot of that stuff is coming. Working on stuff just to make a Black Ops 4 a lot more enjoyable for you guys uh, to. I mean, not only play but to watch, to watch, and also for us to record. You know what I mean? Working out different stuff. Trust me. Yeah, 
honestly believe that we can make Black Ops 4 enjoyable again. Really, honestly, I really do. I feel like it's up to us. A lot of it is up to us to make Black Ops 4, you know, seem enjoyable to play, uh, give like people different ideas and stuff like that. Like, put the blame on Treyarch and all though, if new content did come out, it would be a lot easier. There's stuff we can do as well. Still, this is a whole game. We can definitely make some good content on it. Do you know what I mean? That's basically what I'm trying to say to you guys, man. Stay tuned, because we, we got some stuff coming. A few moments. I'm done, man. I just quit the app. I just got heated. Uh, <laughs> I love this game, man, but I still get heated, of course. But, yo, I appreciate you guys watching, man. Please do let me know what you guys think. I know this video is a little bit different to what I've been doing recently. Now, I've got some good ideas coming. Trust me, I just want to let you guys know what's going on. Where my head's at. And honestly, it's just made me more motivated to make be better content. Honestly, that's what it is. And that's a fact, man, for real. But, yo, thanks for watching, man. I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah.